we are going to find the surface area of a 2 by 3 by 5 rectangular prism. It is important to be careful here because a common mistake is to multiply 2 times 3 times 5. That calculation gives us 30, but that value represents the volume, not the surface area. Surface area measures the total area of all the outer faces of a three-dimensional figure. To better understand this, we can take the rectangular prism and unfold it into a two-dimensional shape called a net. When we look at the net, we can see that the rectangular prism is made up of six rectangular faces. Specifically, there are two rectangles that are two by three, two rectangles that are two by five, and two rectangles that are three by five. Next, we find the area of each type of face. A two by three rectangle has an area of six square units. Since there are two of these faces, their combined area is 12 square units. A two by five rectangle has an area of 10 square units. With two of these faces, the total area is 20 square units. A three by five rectangle has an area of 15 square units. Doubling that gives us 30 square units. Finally, we add the areas of all six faces. 12 plus 20 plus 30 equals 62 square units. That means the surface area of the rectangular prism is 62 square units, which represents the total number of square units needed to completely cover all six faces of the prism.